So it is Friday, October 11th, and in the early hours of today, we actually broke a record for low temperature this morning at nine degrees. So needless to say, it's that time of year to start finding indoor activities. And luckily for you, the Denver Museum of Nature and Science has you covered with an exhibit all ages will absolutely love. <laughs> I remember seeing Toy Story in theaters when I was like three or four years old, and I just remember my jaw dropping. I could not believe what I was seeing, and so the fact that I get to see the science behind it, I am extremely excited about that. The exhibit walks you through every step of the pipeline, which is Pixar's process for creating movies. So each step will go into like modeling your character, creating its skin, the surfaces on it, giving it fur and texture and stuff like that. It's so accessible, especially to children and to folks my age who grew up with these films. It's so already so interesting and so exciting. And then when you learn about all of those other parts coming together and then seeing all of the math and science that goes into creating that artistic piece is really exciting and really interesting. Then you can add some rain to your thunderstorm. I've been walking around the exhibit for like 10 minutes and I already know I have to come back. Because seriously, every station you go to, you just want to like hang out for 10 or 15 minutes and just mess around with the stuff. Especially like something like this, like the stop motion animation where you can just do your own stop motion. I, I could spend an hour here doing this stuff. What I really hope people are also taking away is how much work and effort and detail and choice goes into every little piece of these movies, that every little piece is an artistic choice and someone is sitting there making it. Um, and I also hope that they take away some inspiration to create something of their own. My friends on staff have told me when they leave the exhibit, they just want to go home and watch all the Pixar movies. So I'm not joking. This vlog could be at least three hours long because I just want to sit down at every spot and just mess around with all the sliders. It's incredible. I'm definitely coming back. I highly recommend come to see how your favorite Pixar movies are made. Come learn about things about your favorite Pixar movies that you had no idea, or just come straight up for the nostalgia.